Phillies District Softball coming up versus Brownfield. of Denver City High School Sports on KIKZ AM 1250, KIKZKSEM.com, and on YouTube at KIKZ 1250 DC. We want to thank all our friends and sponsors that support our station and our students and staff that represent Denver City High School in all their activities. We hope you enjoy our coverage of Mustang and Philly sports. Now here's your host, the voice of Denver City Sports, Bo Wells. 
Well, hello and welcome to another district ball game as the Phillies get ready to take on Brownfield here today at home. <clears throat> we'll get into our Ellison Farms pregame show. Right after this. Farmers and ranchers are the backbone of America, working from sunup to sundown, taking care of the land and the livestock, and providing food and fiber for the world. Farmers are our heroes, the ones who make daily sacrifices and face harsh challenges so that we may all enjoy the fruits of their labors. It's the hardworking men and women of agriculture that provide economic security in rural communities and beyond. So we celebrate the men and women that rise up against factors outside of their control to provide for their fellow man. Ellison Farms is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. And thank you to Ellison Farms for our pregame show all year. As we get in here and look at our stats for softball here today. There's your top 10 in the state. Cahoma at 15-0. Franklin 21-1-1. Blue Ridge at 15-1. Hallettsville 22-2. DeKalb is 12-1. Jacksboro 17-3. Queen City 11-2. Anderson Shiro. 14 and 2, Wall 17 and 3, Cold Springs Oakhurst at 13 and 2. For our district, Muleshoe and Littlefield tied at the top at 1 and 0 in district play. Muleshoe 18 and 4 overall, Littlefield 11 and 2. Brownfield comes in 10 and 10, 0 and 1 in district. Phillies 6 and uh, 14 at 0 and 1 in district play, and Lamisa at 7 and 4 overall, as they will play their first district game tonight. First district game for the Phillies was lost to Littlefield in a game that both teams made big runs. Uh, Phillies got back in that game twice, but ended up losing 21 to 11. For Brownfield, they opened with a loss to Muleshoe, uh, eight to nine in that one. So both teams coming in here. Today we will play Muleshoe on Saturday. Brownfield will have La Mesa on Saturday. As they finish getting their lineups ready, we'll get ours ready here. We'll be back with the start of Philly softball on KIKZ 1250 AM on YouTube. You're listening to Denver City Sports on KIKZ 1250 AM Sound of the Mustang. Looking for a place to find gifts for a birthday or a special holiday or just something for yourself? Look no further than That's So Cute Resin. We specialize in personalized, unique gifts from pins, badge reels, dominoes, earrings, personalized cups, and memory preserving items. You name it, we probably can do it. Call 806 215 4876 or look us up on Facebook and Instagram. That's So Cute Resin is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. Welcome back. We'll get into our Beck Trucking starting lineup for both teams for Brownfield Lady Cubs. Number one, the pitcher, Dominguez. Number 13, out in left field, Martinez. Number three, shortstop, Elise. Number four, at first base, Gutierrez. Number 44, at second base, Franco. Number 25, the designated hitter, Burns. Number two, at third base, Gonzalez. Number nine, in left field, Gonzalez. Number 19, the catcher, Bandman. And number seven, in right field, Silva. For the Phillies, batting first, number two, center fielder, Mariela Ceniceros. Number 10, at shortstop, Ashley Martinez. Number five, and in the circle pitching today, Annalie Larea. Number 21, at right field, Eva Gonzalez. Number 22, at third base, Jasmine Villarreal. 34, Jacqueline Mendoza at first base. Number 27, Michaeli Villarreal at catcher. 32, Mia Carson. Casira, uh, designated hitter. Number three, Isabella Briantis at second. And number nine, Jackie Lozano in left field. That's our starting lines. We'll be right back. 
Denver City Thriftway at 713 West Broadway in Denver City is always working hard to serve your grocery needs with quality name brand products along with the lowest prices possible. When you shop your local Denver City Thriftway store, you can be assured of the freshest products available and a good selection. Denver City Thriftway appreciates your business and continues working hard to serve you with great products and friendly service. Denver City Thriftway, a proud supporter of the Denver City Mustangs and Phillies. This is Saul Gutierrez, head basketball coach of the Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ, 1250 AM, Sound of the Phillies. The Denver City Independent School District strives to foster a respectful, safe, and challenging environment that provides all students opportunities to discover their full potential and become lifelong learners. Denver City ISD offers a variety of educational services for its students and is proud of its state-of-the-art facilities and state award-winning programs in academics, fine arts, career and technology, and athletics. No matter what your child strives to be, there's a place for them in DCISD, where positive relationships are the foundation of success. Go Mustangs and Phillies! whatever it takes. Just Supplies, located 825 East Broadway in Denver City, has got you covered for just about anything you need in the oil field, along with equipment rental and household supplies. Regardless of what you need, Just Supplies probably has it or can get it quickly. Stop in today and let the friendly folks help you with all your supply needs. Call 806-592-5878. Just Supplies, a proud supporter of the Mustangs and Phillies. This is Daniel Fontenot, AD head football coach of Denver City, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250, Town of Denver City Sports. The City of Denver City and Denver City Gas System are happy to help with the broadcast of this game. Call City Hall for details about our natural gas system and for questions you might have about using our Gas and Sunny program to help with financing for your gas heating and air conditioning system needs. Let us tell you about the advantages of using clean, economical, and efficient natural gas to heat your home and your water. The Denver City Gas System is city-owned and operated and locally controlled. Go Gas and Go Mustangs and Phillies! This is Tony Livingston, defensive coordinator for the Denver City Mustangs, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Mustangs. Hi, I'm Rob Franklin. When I'm not doing games on the radio for the Tribe, I work for West Texas Fire and Industrial Supply with City Janitorial right here in Seminole. We sell fire extinguishers, first aid, PPE, pressure washers, and a full line of cleaning and janitorial supplies. I'm a certified portable fire extinguisher inspector, and I can swap recharges and service them for you as well. Call me at 432-788-6400 or email me at rob at wtxsupply.com for West Texas Fire and City Janitorial. For over 25 years, Mustang Country in Denver City, Texas has served West Texas and Southeastern New Mexico customers with the best that Chevrolet and Buick have to offer. Whether it's a new or used car, you'll have access to various financing options designed to fit your budget needs. We're a one-stop shop for all your automotive needs. Mustang Country is a proud supporter of Denver City and its community. Mustang Country, 604 West Broadway. We've got you covered with our friendly, courteous, and professional staff. Go Mustangs and Phillies! This is Cecil Robles. You're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM Radio, the sound of the Mustangs and Phillies. Who doesn't love being number one? When your team's dominating the standings, or your favorite band rocks the charts at number one, it feels good, right? Kind of like how it feels when you have auto insurance with State Farm. Because making...
to get started here today in district game number two for the Phillies as they get ready to take on the Brownfield Lady Cubs. Both <coughs> teams come in at 0-1-1 on the year. So somebody's looking to get a victory here today. We'll have Mustang Baseball on Saturday from Muleshoe. So we'll have that coming up on Saturday. As that will be their district opener. Phillies will play in Muleshoe as well at the same time. But we will get the boys game from Muleshoe. Billy's looking to get back on track, scored a bunch of runs the other day. Uh, just couldn't get any anything going at the right time, but they, they played really well at times. So we'll get everything set up here to get the scoreboard working. Brownfield lost in a close one in their opener against Muleshoe, 9-8, to start out their district play. So, First up for the Lady Cubs, the pitcher, number one, Dominguez. So Dominguez, the batter here for Brownfield. To start it off here against Anali. Here's the first pitch. Squares the bunt, pulls back high for ball one. count here to Dominguez and the pitch from Annalise just squared a bunt that one's fouled off and we'll go even at one and one in the count here to the leadoff batter for the Lady Cubs one one count here nobody on nobody out top of the first and the pitch. That one's in the dirt. Two and one now. Wind blowing out to right center today. Henley comes set here for the two one pitch. Squares the bunt, bounded, and fouled off. Just did. Hit the dirt there. 2-2 two, two count now. Two balls, two strikes here to Dominguez. And the 
pitch. Hit out to right field and caught. Out in right field by Eva Gonzalez for out number one. So one away now. That'll bring up number 13, the left fielder, Martinez, for the Lady Cubs. And the pitch, a little high in the zone there for ball one. One ball, no strikes. One out here in the inning. Nobody on for the Lady Cubs. And that's hit out to center and gone for a home run by Martinez to put the Lady Cubs on the board here in the first. So one and nothing on the Thriftway scoreboard. As Ma Martinez hit that just perfect with a win. Just right of center field. That's exactly where it's blowing out. Pretty good gust here. That'll bring up number three, the shortstop, Salas. gathers back up here after the long ball. Good pitch inside. Catches the corner of the plate for strike one. That one inside. Evens the count. That one and one here to the three hole hitter. Ball, one strike, Anna Lee, and the pitch. That one hit between short and third. And the runner will hold it first. For base hit there for Brownfield. They have one on and one out here in the inning. That'll bring up number four, the first baseman, Gutierrez. One to nothing here in the top of the first on the Thriftway scoreboard after a long ball by Brownfield. Throw down the second tag, not in time. So the first pitch was called a ball here. And now the pitch. Inside for ball two. Two balls and one strike here to the batter, Gutierrez. Inside popped up right here by home plate and it gets out of play for strike one. Two one count here to the Brownfield first baseman. Honolese pitch swung on and missed. Two-two count, one out, runner at second for the Lady Cubs. And the two-two. That one misses and we'll go full in the count now to Gutierrez. So 
So Annalee here with a payoff pitch. And that one is hit hard down the third base line just off the glove. It'll get in the outfield, and Brownfield will score a run on a double there by Gutierrez. Two to nothing now here in the top of the first on the Thriftway scoreboard. Got to be up number 44, the second baseman, Franco. Runner at second with a one out. And that one's hit to second. Mishandled there. Brownfield's going to score another run here. Error charge to the Phillies there. And the pitch here to Burns. Squares to Bunt, puts one down in no man's land, and everyone's safe on the play for a hit there by the designated hitter, Burns. So runners at first and second now for the Lady Cubs. With one out here in the top of the first, three to nothing, Brownfield. Third baseman number two, Gonzalez at the plate for the Lady Cubs. Throw down to third. Not in time and everybody will move up a bag here. Second and third now. Oh. oh and one here, here's the pitch. Hit hard to the shortstop, stabs it. And the tag is applied. Another run does score. Runner at first now for the Lady Cubs. So on a fielder's choice there. And strike one in there to start off. The other Gonzalez, the center fielder. And the pitch, that one's popped up in the infield. Isabella Barrientes makes the catch for out number three. And we'll go to the bottom half of the first. Brownfield four and the Phillies nothing. LG Services in Denver City can handle your oil field service needs with pump trucks, vacuum trucks, haul trucks, winch trucks, light plants, frack tanks, bobcat shredder, clean batteries, and much more. If you need oil field service work done, LG Services in Denver City is the company to call. 806-215-2628. That number again, 806-215-2628. LG Services backing the Denver City Mustangs and Phillies. This is Brian Lewis, assistant coach for the Mustangs. You're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, the sound of the Mustangs. Kill Mud and Chemicals, LLC in Denver City, produces high-quality weighted kill and workover fluids in the oil and gas industry. Kill Mud and Chemicals serves West Texas and Eastern New Mexico, operating 24 hours a day, seven days a week to accommodate our customers' needs. Call Mark at 806-215-0751 or stop by the plant at 1570 County Road 390 in Denver City. Kill Mud and Chemicals, a proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. Espinosa Services is proud to support our local businesses. In order to build a strong economy in our hometown area, we'd like to challenge our local businesses to contribute to building a better future for our children. We're proud to be a part of the West Texas community. Espinosa Services is deep-rooted. We support our local businesses and schools, and we strive to build a better surrounding community for all of us. We're so proud to live and work in our small-town communities. Espinosa Services, we've been here, we will be here. 
This is Doug Duncan, Offensive Coordinator for the Mustangs, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250, Sound of the Mustangs. Hicks Air and Supply, located at 204 North Main in Denver City, is home owned and operated. 806-592-3930. That's for all your air conditioning and heating repair needs. You'll deal with someone with the tools, the training, and the know-how to make your home more comfortable than you've ever experienced. And if you need a new unit, Hicks Air and Supply can handle that too. Hicks Air and Supply, proud supporters of the Mustangs and the Philly. Stop by Hicks Air and Supply, 204 North Main in Denver City. Welcome back to Philly softball here in the bottom half of the first. Philly's trail four to nothing here to Brownfield. They started it off with a leadoff home run, and then scored a run on an error. And uh, Philly, finally, Philly's got out of the inning. Number two, Mariella Sinicero, center fielder for the Phillies to start it off here. Dominguez, the pitcher for Brownfield here today, ball one to start off Mariella. And the 1-0. Swung on and missed. And the count goes 1-1 here to Mariela Ceniceros. Settled in. Here's the pitch. That one misses the zone outside for ball two. 21 the count. And the pitch from Dominguez. Popped up. That one will get out of play. And the count will go to 2-2 here to Mariella. Two balls, two strikes here. Dominguez settles back in the circle. Here's the pitch to Mariella. And that one's hit hard down the line, but foul. So it will stay 2-2 in the count. Two-two hey, outside, outside, outside. count. Mariella fights one off here, stays alive. In the count. And the pitch. And a swing and a miss. And that'll be a strikeout for the first out of the inning for the Phillies. That'll bring up number 10, Ashley Martinez, the shortstop for the Phillies today. go with Ashley Martinez. One out, nobody on. And the pitch. Misses up high and inside for ball, for ball one. And the pitch fouled off. And 1-1 one, one now. One ball, one strike here to Ashley Martinez. Billy's looking to get something going here. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. Long shot out to center field, and it's gone. A home run by Ashley Martinez. Puts the Phillies on the board. So right back at them. Both teams have hit a home run here in the first inning of play. That was a no doubter there by Ashley Martinez. So four to one now on the Thriftway scoreboard. 
that'll bring up the pitcher, Anna Lee Larea. Pitcher on pitcher here. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. And that one fouled off for strike one. No balls, one strike. Nobody on and one out here in the inning. Four to one Brownfield lead. And the pitch. Hit right back at the pitcher hard. Gonna have to run it out and the play is in time for out number two. So two away now in the inning. And that'll bring up number 21, Eva Gonzalez out in right field. She had a home run on Saturday. The first pitch in there for a strike. Two outs, nobody on. 4-1 on the third phase scoreboard. Brownfield on top here. And the pitch from Dominguez. Fouled away. Two strikes now. That battle up there. And the O2. In the dirt. One, two goes the count here. to Eva. And Amika's up high. 2-2 two, two now. Two balls and two strikes here to Eva Gonzalez. And Dominguez's pitch. Gets away from her, we go full. So she's found her way back in here in a full count situation. Two outs and nobody on. And now the payoff pitch here to Eva. Popped up in the infield. Pitcher says she's got it and she does for out number three. Phillies will score one run on one hit, no errors, and leave no one on base. We'll move to the bottom, top half of the first. Four to one on the Thriftway scoreboard. We'll be right back. K and Company Electric, located at 821 North Avenue B in Denver City, is the company to call for all your commercial electrical needs. K and Company Electric serves Yoakum County and the surrounding area in the oil field or on the farm with dependable electrical service. Just give them a call at 806-592-3513. Licensed in Texas and New Mexico, K & Company is the name you've come to know and trust through the years. So when the need calls for commercial electric service, let K & Company go do the work for you. This is Jennifer Gonzalez, head softball coach of the Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Phillies. CJR Contractors has been serving the oil field industry with efficient quality work since 1964. With rustabout services, backhoes, vacuum excavation, dump trucks, boom lifts, chain link fencing, soil bioremediation, lease operators, oil field maintenance, and much more. You can depend on CJR Contractors for all your oil field service needs. Call 806-592-2558 for efficient, reliable service that you can always depend on. CJR Contractors, located 401 West Broadway in Denver City. This is Celeste Garcia, head cross country coach, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of Denver City Sport. Sundown State Bank can handle all your banking needs. Stop in at Sundown State Bank in Denver City, Brownfield, Level Land, Sundown, and Wall. 
He'll always get friendly professional hometown service. Come by 202 West Broadway in Denver City and visit with one of our local bankers for all your personal or business banking needs. Sundown State Bank. Up to lead it off in the second for Brownfield. Bondman, the catcher. Denver City, member FDIC. And the first pitch fouled away for strike one. No balls and one strike here. No balls and a strike here to Bondman. And the pitch. Bunted and fouled off for strike two. No balls, two strikes here to the Brownfield catcher. Up high for ball one. And the count goes one, two here to Bondman. Four to one, Lady Cub lead on the third way scoreboard. And that one fouled up out of play. And we'll stay one, two in the count here. Top of the second, four to one, Brownfield lead on the Thriftway scoreboard. Is Annalise set for the one two here? And the pitch. And that one gets away from her a little bit up high, and we go two two in the count now. Two balls and two strikes. Nobody out, nobody on. Time called by the batter. And the pitch. Inside and the count goes full. Nine hole hitter for Brownfield here. So full count. And Lee's payoff pitch on the way inside and She'll put her on with a base on balls here. So the leadoff batter on here in the inning for Brownfield. Go back to the top of the order with the pitcher, Dominguez. Flat out to right field her first time up. And the pitch. Squares to bunt, pulls back, throw down to second. And the throwdown was in time. The Kaylee Villarreal throws out the Brownfield runner. For the first out of the inning. Good play there. Heads up play by the freshman. At shortstop, good throw by Kaylee Villarreal. Freshman Ashley Martinez had that straightaway center home run to start the Phillies off on the board. And the pitch, bunted. Dominguez tries to run it out, and she will not as the Phillies get the out. Two outs now in the inning, nobody on. Good defensive inning here by the Phillies. That'll bring up number 13, the left fielder Martinez to the plate for the Lady Cubs.
And Annalise Pitch. Hit right back to her. She'll pick it up, throw over to first for out number three, and the Phillies go one, two, three here in the inning. Three up, three down. No hits, no runs, no errors, no one left on for Brownfield. Move to the bottom half of the second. Four to one, Brownfield lead. This is Darla Gleaves, athletic trainer for Denver City High School, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, the sound of Denver City Sports. Want to turn your truck into the ultimate workhorse or off-road beast? The possibilities are endless when you visit Rascal Supply in Seminole. Rascal has truck accessories, spray-in bed liners, bed covers, lift kits, toolboxes, leveling kits, and so much more. Come see us at 1303 North Main or call 432-758-3280 for Rascal Supply on the north side of Seminole. When you need heavy hauling in the oil field, call the experts, Pate Trucking, at 806-592-2772 in Denver City. Pate Trucking has you covered with transports, vacuum trucks, kill trucks, haul trucks, and winch trucks. Call Pate Trucking today for test tanks, frack tanks, pipe trailers, and forklifts. Pate Trucking is the proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. This is Megan David, head volleyball coach of the Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Phillies. Quality Truck Tires in Denver City can handle all your tire needs. Light truck, passenger tires, and commercial truck tires with all major brands to choose from. Michelin, BF Goodrich, Cooper, and Hercules. Remember, Quality Truck Tires can also take care of your vehicle maintenance needs, oil and filter change, vehicle alignment, brake work, air conditioner service, and much more. For all your vehicle tire and maintenance needs, give Quality Truck Tire a call at 806-592-2152. And the pitch here to start off. Jasmine Villarreal here in the bottom of the second. Bottom half of the second, four to one, Brownfield lead. Here's the pitch. That one misses for ball two. Here's Jasmine. And that one's high, and we go 3-0 in the count here. As the Phillies look to get the leadoff batter on here in the second. Pitch in the dirt, and sure enough, Phillies will get the leadoff batter on with the base on balls. That'll bring up Jack uh, uh, Jack Mendoza playing first base for the Phillies today. Runner on first with nobody out here. pitch and that one hit hard out the left center field and gone a home run by Jocelyn Mendoza and now the Phillies trail just by one here two home runs on the day for the Phillies in two innings That'll bring up McKaylee Villarreal. She's had a couple of home runs this year. Had one against Lovington. As that ball misses the zone. And the K 
Count goes 1-0 here to McKaylee Villarreal. And the pitch. That one's fouled out of play. And 1-1 goes the count here. Bottom of the second, 4-3 Brownfield lead. And the pitch. Strike called right there. And the count goes one ball, two strikes here to McKaylee Villarreal. Got to protect the plate here now. And the pitch. Swung on, that one's fouled out of play. So we'll do it again here. And the one two here from Dominguez. Up in the zone, two two. Two balls, two strikes, nobody on, nobody out here. And the two two. Stays alive. Anything close and she's fighting them off here. Two, two count. Kaylee fighting up at the plate here. Here's the pitch. That one's in the dirt, and the count goes full. Here's the payoff pitch from Dominguez. And that one misses the zone and puts McKaylee Villarreal on here with nobody out and a runner on first. That'll bring up Mia Casares for the Phillies. Designated hitter. She's hitting in place of Jackie Lozano, who is playing in left field. First pitch in there for strike one. Runner at first with nobody out here in the inning. That one in the dirt. We go even at one and one here to Mia. Phillies have pushed across two runs here in the bottom of the second to pull within one of Brownfield and the pitch. One ball, two strikes now. And a strikeout there for Dominguez. First out of the inning. And that'll bring up number three, the second baseman, senior Isabella Barrientes. Pitch to El Isabella inside and low for ball one. One ball, no strikes here. And the pitch from Dominguez. Fouled off. One one. Count to Isabella. And the pitch, that one's high. Throw down the first, not in time. 2-1 count. Two balls and one strike here to Isabella. In the bottom half of the second with a runner on first with 
One out in the inning. 4-3 Brownfield lead. And the pitch. And that misses. 3-1 now the count. Three balls, one strike here. And the pitch from Dominguez. And she'll put her on. Two runners on now for the Phillies. <laughs> we'll go back to the top of the order with the center fielder, number two, Mariela Ceniceros. And that one fouled down the third base line and out of play. And we'll start her off 0-1 here in the count. One misses in the zone. One one goes the count. That one in the dirt. Two one. Two balls, one strike, two runners on, one out. Here's the pitch. In the dirt again, and we go 3-1. And time called by the catcher. She'll go out and talk to Dominguez here and try to regather her pitcher. Three balls and one strike to count on Mariela Ceniceros. Runners at first and second for the Phillies with a one out here in the bottom half of the second. Brownfield leads it four to three on the Thriftway scoreboard. Recap how we got here in the first. Brownfield started off with a home run, then a base hit. And then a double and scored a run, an error scored a run, and then a fielder's choice scored a run. And the Phillies scored on a uh, solo home run by Ashley Martinez in the first, and then a home run by uh, Jacqueline Mendoza drove in a run. So 4-3, here's the pitch. Popped up in the infield. Batters out on the inflailed fly rule. So two outs in the inning. Runner still at first and second for the Phillies. Got to bring up Ashley Martinez. Let's see if she can follow that up. Solo shot up. And that one she got a piece of, fouled it off. Oh, one. Here's the pitch. Inside for ball one. One, one. Goes the count. Here's the one, one to Ashley. Good little flare blooper out into right field. They'll send the runner home. No play at the plate. Now throw down to second and she or third. She's in time. Phillies tie it on that hit by Ashley Martinez. Runners at second and third now. Two outs in the inning and the pitch. Misses. Anali Larea. Grounded out to short to start her at bat in the first. And the pitch. One one count. As that one caught the corner of the plate on the outside. And the 
And the pitch. That one misses low. We'll go 2 1 in the count now here at Anna Lee. Runners at second and third with two outs. 4 4 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. Inside. Fly out to the gap in left center. That'll score one. That'll score two. And a double by Anna Lee. Six four Philly lead. Bring up Eva Gonzalez now to the plate for the Phillies. And that one fouled off. For strike one. And the 0-1 in the dirt. 1-1 one, one goes the count. One one from Dominguez. Wow, I agree with that one. It's almost up in her chin. Called it a strike. One ball, two strikes now. And that one misses the zone. Now we go even at two two. Runner at second with two outs. As Eva settles back in here, 2-2 two -two pitch. And that one popped up. Center falls down and another run scores and a double for Eva Gonzalez. And it's seven to four. And the Phillies have batted around here in the inning, so we'll go back to Jasmine Villarreal. And the pitch, that one misses. For ball one. <clears throat> Runner at second with two outs. That one misses. We go 2-0 in the count now. Jasmine, 0-2, make it 3-0 now in the count here. Now you can be picky. Here's the pitch in the dirt, not a walker. Runners at first and second now for the Phillies. That'll bring up Jacqueline Mendoza hit a home run earlier in the second. <clears throat> a two run shot. And she'll come up here again with runners at first and second with two outs. Jacqueline Mendoza back at the plate for the second time in the inning. Homered earlier in the inning. Let's see if she can repeat that here. And the pitch. That one up in the zone for ball one. Two on and two outs. And the pitch. 
That one misses the zone again as Dominguez struggling here in the second. And the 0-2. And that is hit hard out and gone. A second home run in the same inning by Jacqueline Mendoza. A two-run shot here. Sorry, three-run shot there. That'll put the Phillies up 10 to four on the Thriftway scoreboard. So he turned on that one and hit that one out to left. We'll bring up McKaylee Villarreal to the plate for the Phillies. Still here in the second. Two outs and nobody on. Strike called on the pitch there. <clears throat> Up in the zone. One one. Fouled off. Now we go one, two, one ball, two strikes. Nobody on, two outs here in the inning. Phillies lead it 10-4 on the third way scoreboard. And the pitch. Up for ball two, and we go even at 2-2. Two, two. two balls and two strikes. Here's a pitch from Dominguez. That one's hit out to center. Center fielder comes in and makes the play for out number three. But the Phillies put up nine runs here in the second on five hits. No errors. Leave no one on base. We'll move to the top half of the third with the Phillies out in front. 10 to 4 on the Thriftway scoreboard. When it comes to irrigation systems for your crops, you can measure quality by the length of the warranty. Compare rain keys to the others, and others come up short. Rain keys 10 year, 10,000 hour wheelbox warranty is the longest in the industry. See Bandman Irrigation and Supplies in Denver City today about rain keys long lasting warranties and ask about extending the gearbox warranty on your existing system by two years, regardless of brand. Bandman Irrigation and Supplies in Denver City, 806-592-2011. Take a break from the ordinary and drive into Sonic of Denver City today for a refreshing cold Coca-Cola. While you're there, try one of our delicious hot dogs. To make it even better, top your meal off with an extraordinary real ice cream shake. Don't forget to take advantage of our happy hour from 2 to 4 p.m. daily for half-priced drinks and slushes especially Coca-Cola. This is how you Sonic. This is Bo Wells, the voice of the Mustangs and Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ, 1250 AM, the home for Denver City Sports. Hudson Trucking in Denver City can handle your oil field trucking needs. Give Brady Shivers a call at 432-847-9026 or Rodney at 806-215-6946. Hudson Trucking is locally owned and operated, serving Denver City and the surrounding area with vacuum and pump trucks. You can rely on Hudson Trucking to get the job done right with fast, efficient service. That's Hudson Trucking, a proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. Welcome back to Philly Softball. Here's where we start the top half of the third. Phillies lead it 10-4 over Brownfield. Finally goes back to work here. And the pitch. Hit hard down the third base line. Foul. Salas the batter for Brownfield. Oh, 
0-1 the count. And the pitch. In tight. And the count goes 1-1 here. To Salas. And the 1-1 from Anna Lee. Hit out to right. It'll fall in for a base hit. For Salas, she's got two base hits in the ball game so far. So they'll bring up Gutierrez, the first baseman. For Brownfield, doubled back in the first in the pitch. Up high for ball one. <coughs> and the pitch. Popped up in the infield. Isabella couldn't make the catch. Throw to second. He is out. So they do get an out. First, that'll bring up number 44, Franco. Reached on an error back in the first and scored a run. And the pitch. That one hit down the line. Foul. Out into right field. 0-1 goes the count here. One out. And a runner on first for Brownfield. 10-4 lead for the Phillies. And the 0-1 for Manali. And the count goes even at 1-1 one one here. That one was high. And the 1-1 one from one Manali. Hit out to center field. Ariela Ceniceros couldn't make the play. And the runners will be at first and second now. That'll bring up Burns for Brownfield. Runners at first and second with one out. First and second with one out here. And the pitch. Throw down a third. Got under the tag. And the runners move up here. Second and third with one out. Ball called on the pitch. One ball, no strikes here. And the pitch, square to bunt, and fouls that one off. We'll go 1-1 one, one in the count now. One ball, one strike. Runners at second and third with one out here in the top half of the third. Phillies lead it 10-4. See how the lead comes set in the circle. And the 1-1. Fouled off, and now she goes ahead at 1-2 and two in the count. All right, we 
to get the dog off the field. So Burns steps back in. One ball, two strikes. Finally trying to get the second out of the inning here. Here's the pitch. We'll go even at 2-2. Two, two. two balls and two strikes. And the pitch. Chased it up high for out number two, a strikeout there for Anna Lee. That'll bring up Gonzalez, the third baseman, hit into a fielder's choice the first time up back in the first. And the pitch. Misses high for ball one. And the dog back on the field again here. One ball and no strikes. that taken care of. Top of the third, two outs in the inning. Runners at second and third. And a 1-0 count here to Gonzalez. He's trying to hold Brownfield scoreless here in this inning. As they did in the second, here's the pitch. In the dirt. Two balls, no strikes. And the pitch. Misses high. And now it's 3-0 in the count here. That's Brownfield threatens to load the bases here. Balls and no strikes. And so now the bases are loaded here for Brownfield with two outs in the inning. That'll bring up the other Gonzalez, center fielder for the Cubs. She hits that one hard down the third baseline out in the outfield. It'll score one run and two runs score here for Brownfield on the base hit. We'll have runners at first and second now. Nine hole hitter, Bondman, and the strike to start her off here.
And the pitch hit down the line fair. One run scores. Runners at second and third now. Ten seven Philly lead. And a time called by the Phillies. Back at the top of the lineup for Brownfield, Dominguez, the pitcher. 0 for 2 today. Here's the pitch. Upstairs. Ball one. And the pitch. Fouled off. One one goes the count. Two outs, runners on second and third. Popped up. Out into center. And Mary Ellison Aceros makes the play for out number three. Brownfield will score three runs. On two hits, they'll leave two runners on base. We'll move to the bottom half of the third. The Phillies winning 10-7 on the Thriftway scoreboard. We'll be right back after this. Yoakum County Hospital is always looking for new team members who have a shared passion for our core values of dignity, excellence, service, and justice. If you'd like to be considered for an opportunity with Yoakum County Hospital, go to ych.us slash careers. YCH provides excellent benefits such as employer paid health, cancer and life insurance, competitive salaries and many other benefits. Optional dental, vision, flex plan and ICU coverage is also available. This is Derek Fott, head basketball coach of the Mustangs and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Mustangs. Just Cash, located inside Just Supplies in Denver City, makes it hassle-free to get cash for many types of checks, including payroll checks, personal checks, business checks, income tax refund checks, and more. Just Cash also offers longer service hours than many banks. So just stop in today at Just Cash, 825 East Broadway in Denver City, or call 806-592-5878. Welcome back to Philly softball. Bottom half of the third. Philly's 10, Brownfield 7 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Six hits apiece for both teams. The Phillies have pushed across 10 to Brownfield 7. We have had two errors in the field today. That'll bring up Mia Casares. Struck out her first time up back in the second. And the pitch. In there for strike one to start her off. Two strikes. 
Start off Mia here in the bat. And the pitch, that one's in the dirt. And the pitch. Two, two goes the count here to Mia. Two balls, two strikes, here's the pitch. Misses outside. And now the count full at 3-2. Three, Three balls and two strikes. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. Up high and that'll walk her. That was ball four. Now they say it's full, and then she strikes out. Well, we got short end of the stick on that one. I understand how you don't have the call right behind the plate, but bring up Isabella Barrientes playing second today. Got on with a walk her first time up. And scored a run. Ball one. One ball, no strikes here. To Isabella. Nobody on and one out in the inning. Hit down third baseline, picked up, and foul is the call. So 1-1 one, one goes the count. One ball, one strike, one out, nobody on. For Isabella, here's the pitch from Dominguez. Swing and a miss. And the count goes to one and two. One ball, no strikes. And the pitch in the dirt. Two, two. So we go even here for Isabella. Now full count. And Isabella hanging in there here. Good hit out to center and gone. A home run for Isabella Barrientos. And the Phillies tack on another one. Make it 11 to seven. And a four home run day so far for the Phillies. So Isabella with a shot out to center. Now we'll go to the top of the lineup with Mariela Ceniceros. 0 for 2 today. So she's looking to get a hit here with one out and nobody on. And that one's fouled off. Oh, one the count. One count, one out. Here's the pitch. 
fouled off right here at us. No balls and two strikes now. Nobody out on and one out. 11-7 Philly lead here in game two of district. And the pitch. Popped up. Out into left field. The center fielder calls her off and makes the catch. To bring up Ashley Martinez, the shortstop freshman. Two for two today with a home run and a single scored in the second after being batted around. That one's hit high in the air. Out to right field, and the right fielder makes the catch for out number three in the inning. But the Phillies score one here in the third on a home run by Isabella Barrientes. And the Phillies lead it on the thriftway scoreboard 11-7 over the Brownfield Lady Cubs. We'll be right back after this. West Texas National Bank in Denver City and 12 other locations in West Texas is your one-stop financial institution. West Texas National has all the modern banking conveniences, internet banking and debit cards to traditional accounts, an experienced professional to help with every type of loan, farm and ranch real estate loans for row crop to cattle, ag equipment loans, commercial business loans to home loans, all types of vehicle loans, even recreation vehicles to small consumer purchases. We're West Texas National Bank of Denver City. Freedom Bail Bonds offers fast and reliable assistance with surety bonds and we're open 24-7. Since 1985, we've been providing top-notch service and can help you every step of the way with utmost privacy, professionalism, and speed. A call to Freedom Bail Bond should be your first good decision when you or a loved one is involved in this type of unfortunate situation. Call us at 432-758-3234. Serving Gaines, Yoakum, Dawson, and Andrews Counties. Welcome back to Philly Softball. We start the top of the fours. And up for Brownfield. Will be Martinez. Martinez had a home run back in the first for Brownfield. One for one for two today. And the pitch. Squares the bunt, pulls back, strike one. Nobody on, nobody out. 0-1 count here to Martinez. 11-7 Philly lead on the Thriftway scoreboard. Here's the pitch from Anali. Hit up in the air, out to center. Mariela Ceniceros drifts back and it's gone. Martinez's second home run of the ball game. Eleven eight now. After that home run. Six home runs we've seen here today. Four by the Phillies, two by the Lady Cubs. 11-8 <clears throat> Philly lead. Top of the fourth here. And the pitch. Misses up high for ball one. Salas the batter here. Two for yep, two for two today. And the pitch. Hit right at Isabella and she stabs it on the line drive. Nice play there at second by Isabella Barrientes for out number one. So one out, nobody on. 
and that will bring up the first baseman, Gutierrez, for the Brownfield Lady Cubs. And the pitch from Anali. And misses up high for ball one. And the pitch. Hit hard to short. And it gets by. Out into... Left and a base hit for Gutierrez. That'll bring up Franco to the plate for Brownfield. Runner at first with one out. Franco's reached on both times on two errors. And the pitch turned on foul down the line. So no balls and a strike here to Franco. No balls and a strike here. As Franco steps in. And the pitch. Hit out to center. Mariela Sinisteros in and out of her glove. They'll get the runner out at second, though. Two outs in the inning. Two outs and a runner at first for Brownfield. That'll bring up Burns to the plate. <clears throat> Struck out last time up. And the pitch. Swing. Bunt right back at Annalise. She'll pick it up. Throw to first. In time for out number three. Brownfield will get one run on two hits, no errors, and leave one runner on base. We'll be right back after this. Mustang Country timeout. Barbers and ranchers are the backbone of America, working from sunup to sundown, taking care of the land and the livestock, and providing food and fiber for the world. Farmers are our heroes, the ones who make daily sacrifices and face harsh challenges so that we may all enjoy the fruits of their labors. It's the hardworking men and women of agriculture that provide economic security in rural communities and beyond. So we celebrate the men and women that rise up against factors outside of their control to provide for their fellow man. Ellison Farms is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. You're listening to Denver City Sports on KIKZ 1250 AM Sound of the Mustang and Phillies. Looking for a place to find gifts for a birthday or a special holiday or just something for yourself? Look no further than That's So Cute Resin. We specialize in personalized, unique gifts from pins, badge reels, dominoes, earrings, personalized cups, and memory preserving items. You name it, we probably can do it. Call 806-215-4876 or look us up on Facebook and Instagram. That So Cute Resin is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. Welcome back to Philly Softball. The Phillies lead it 11-8 here over Brownfield as we move to the bottom half of the fourth. And Anna Lee... Larea will step to the plate for the Phillies here. One for two today with a double and scored a run in the second. <clears throat> and the pitch. 
and misses outside for ball one. One ball and no strikes here. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground to short. She'll pick it up, throw to first. In time for out number one. Eva Gonzalez, the batter now for the Phillies. She's one for two today. With a double and scored a run in the second. Pitch starter off. And that's hit down the left field line and off the fence. Throw into second. And she's in there safe. At second base with a double. So two doubles today by Eva Gonzalez. So a runner at second with one out here in the inning. That'll bring up Jasmine Villarreal. She's reached twice on balls today. Scored two runs. Here's the pitch. Holds off on one. Down in the zone for ball one. One ball, no strikes, one out. Runner at second for the Phillies. 11-8 lead for the Phillies here in the bottom half of the fourth. Here's Dominguez's pitch. In tight for ball two. He would just miss that home run on that last one. He hit the top of the fence just below the top rail. Got her in scoring position. Here's the pitch. That one's outside and low. And 3-0 goes the count here to Jasmine Villarreal. And the 3-0. In there for strike one. Makes it 3-1 in the count. Three balls and one strike here is the count. And the pitch. Hit to short. Throw to first in time. Runner stays at second. So two outs now. And that will bring up Jacqueline Mendoza. She's got two home runs here already. And they're going to intentional walk her. So two on now. Two on and two outs. And that will bring up McKaylee Villarreal for the Phillies. And the pitch. Fouled off out of play for strike one. And the pitch. Fouled off. Strike two now. No balls and two strikes. Two outs, two runners on. Here's the pitch up high in the zone for ball one. And the pitch. That one's low. 2-2. Two -two. Two, two count. Here's the pitch. And that one misses the zone. And it's a full count here to McKaylee Villarreal.
And a pitch. Misses. And the bases are loaded for the Phillies. Base is loaded to bring up Mia Casares. She struck out both times at the plate. So looking to get some runs in here. Base is loaded with two outs. Here's the pitch inside. Ball one. One ball, no strikes here to Mia. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. And a swing and a miss. And the count goes even at 1-1. One, one. one ball, one strike. Here's the pitch. Misses. 2-1. Misses inside and low. Three balls and one strike here. Three, one the count. And the pitch. Fouled off in a full count now with the bases loaded. Full count with the bases loaded. Full count with the bases loaded here. Bottom of the fourth, Phillies lead it 11-8, and the bases are loaded with two outs. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground to short. She'll pick it up, throw to first in time for out number three. So the Phillies get one hit there in the fourth. They'll strand it with the bases loaded. We'll move to the top of the fifth on the Thriftway scoreboard, 11-8, Philly lead. Denver City Thriftway at 713 West Broadway in Denver City is always working hard to serve your grocery needs with quality name brand products along with the lowest prices possible. When you shop your local Denver City Thriftway store, you can be assured of the freshest products available and a good selection. Denver City Thriftway appreciates your business and continues working hard to serve you with great products and friendly service. Denver City Thriftway, a proud supporter of the Denver City Mustangs and Phillies. This is Saul Gutierrez, head basketball coach of the Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Phillies. The Denver City Independent School District strives to foster a respectful, safe, and challenging environment that provides all students opportunities to discover their full potential and become lifelong learners. Denver City ISD offers a variety of educational services for its students and is proud of its state-of-the-art facilities and state award-winning programs in academics, fine arts, career and technology, and athletics. No matter what your child strives to be, there's a place for them in DCISD, where positive relationships are the foundation of success. Go Mustangs and Phillies! whatever it takes. Just Supplies, located 825 East Broadway in Denver City, has got you covered for just about anything you need in the oil field, along with equipment rental and household supplies. Regardless of what you need, Just Supplies probably has it or can get it quickly. Stop in today and let the friendly folks help you with all your supply needs. Call 806-592. At the plate to start the top half of the fifth for Brownfield will be Gonzalez inside that misses. Should be Gonzalez, but it's not. It's pitch. It is Gonzalez. So Gonzalez the batter. 
two balls to start her off here. In the top half of the fifth, the Phillies lead it 11-8 on the third way scoreboard. Two zero count on the pitch. Fouled off, and the count goes two one here to the third baseman Gonzalez. pitch and the count goes 3-1 here to Gonzalez 11-8 on the Thriftway scoreboard and the pitch from Manali popped up in the shallow right and a good play there by Eva Gonzalez out in right field. That'll bring up the center fielder Gonzalez to the plate for Brownfield. One for two today for her. And that one misses. One out, nobody on. And the 1-0 for Anna Lee. And 2-0 goes the count. Two balls, no strikes. One out, nobody on. Top of the fifth, 11-8 Philly lead. And the pitch. 3-0 now goes the count. Three zero count. Stanley comes set. Here's the pitch to Gonzalez, and that one catches the corner. Three one. Put her on with a walk. Bring up the nine hole hitter, Bondman. She's doubled and walked today. <clears throat> One out and a runner on first. pitch. Popped up out of play for strike one. <clears throat> oh one. Pitch from Anali. Good pitch. Throw down to second. In time, right on top of the helmet. Got her. Good throw. Two outs now in the inning. And two strikes on the batter. O2 count. No balls and two strikes. Two outs, nobody on. Top of the fifth. And the pitch from Anna Lee. That one gets away from her. 
One ball, no strikes. To the nine hole hitter, Bondman. Eleven eight Philly lead. Here's the pitch from Anna Lee. Oh, in and out the glove of the third baseman. Jasmine Villarreal. Gotta squeeze it. Puts one on for Brownfield. Two outs and a runner on first. We'll go to the top. Of the order. With the pitcher, Dominguez. Hit out to right center field. It falls in. It's going to roll all the way to the fence. The relay in. And it'll be a double and a run scored for Brownfield. Right back at her. Throw into home, cut off. And the tag not applied in time. Eleven ten on the third place scoreboard. And the one oh. Goes two oh now. And the pitch from Emily. Hit out to right center. It'll fall in. Bounce off the fence. Relay in. Cut off and a run scores. That'll bring up Gutierrez now to the plate for Brownfield. Runner at second. But two outs. And the pitch gets away from her. And the runner will get down to third. Side. Tied at 11 on the third way scoreboard. Three three goes the count now, and the pitch from Anali. Three one now. Runner in a run down throw home tag applied and she's out. Let's go. 
Well, Brownfield will push across three runs in that inning on three hits. They'll leave no one on base. We'll move to the bottom of the fifth. Tied at 11. This is Daniel Fontenot, AD head football coach at Denver City, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250, Town of Denver City Sports. The City of Denver City and Denver City Gas System are happy to help with the broadcast of this game. Call City Hall for details about our natural gas system and for questions you might have about using our Gas and Sunny program to help with financing for your gas heating and air conditioning system needs. Let us tell you about the advantages of using clean, economical, and efficient natural gas to heat your home and your water. The Denver City Gas System is city-owned and operated and locally controlled. Go Gas and Go Mustangs and Phillies. This is Tony Livingston, defensive coordinator for the Denver City Mustangs, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Mustangs. Hi, I'm Rob Franklin. When I'm not doing games on the radio for the Tribe, I work for West Texas Fire and Industrial Supply with City Janitorial right here in Seminole. We sell fire extinguishers, first aid, PPE, pressure washers, and a full line of cleaning and janitorial supplies. I'm a certified portable fire extinguisher inspector, and I can swap recharges and service them for you as well. Call me at 432-788-6400 or email me at rob at wtxsupply.com for West Texas Fire and City Janitorial. Welcome back to Philly Softball as we move to the bottom half of the fifth, and we're tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Isabella Barrientes will start it off for the Phillies. Homered last inning. Out to center here. And the pitch. Ball one. <laughs> 1 0. And the pitch. Popped up in the air. Short stop. Calls for it. And makes the play. Four out number one. We'll go to the top of the order with Mary Ellis Sinaceros <coughs> coming to the plate. 0 for 3 today. Strikeout and two flyouts on the day. Looking for a big hit here for the Phillies as we're tied at 11 late in this one in the bottom of the fifth. And the pitch from Dominguez in the dirt for ball one. And the 1 0 here from Dominguez. Hard shot, foul down the third baseline by Mariella. We'll go 1-1 one, one in the count now here. One out, nobody on. Bottom of the fifth, tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard here in district play. Both teams looking for their first district win. And the pitch. And misses in the zone for ball two. Two won the count. And that one misses and it goes three one in the count. Three balls, one strike here to Mariela Sinaceros. And now it's full. As they jammed her up inside. And the pitch caught the plate. Full count and a payoff pitch coming from Dominguez. That got away from her. Puts Mariella Sinaceros on base with one out in the inning. That'll bring up number 10, shortstop 
Ashley Martinez. Homer back in the first. Long shot to straightaway center. Strike one to start her off here in the bottom of the fifth with a runner on and one out. Tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Popped up. Center fielder under it and makes the play for out number two. Annalie Larea steps to the plate. One for three today. With a base hit and a run scored. Was a double back in the second. One on and two outs. Here's a pitch. Right down the middle for strike one. And Dominguez's pitch. Bouncer in the dirt. Mariella back in time. 1-1 one, one count. One ball, one strike here. Two outs and a runner at first for Anna Lee. At the plate. And the pitch. Popped up to the left side. Left fielder comes in and makes the play for the third out of the inning. Phillies go down in order. One, two, three there in the bottom half of the fifth. We'll move to the top of the sixth now with us tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. We'll be right back. For over 25 years, Mustang Country in Denver City, Texas has served West Texas and Southeastern New Mexico customers with the best that Chevrolet and Buick have to offer. Whether it's a new or used car, you'll have access to various financing options designed to fit your budget needs. We're a one-stop shop for all your automotive needs. Mustang Country is a proud supporter of Denver City and its community. Mustang Country, 604 West Broadway. We've got you covered with our friendly, courteous, and professional staff. Go Mustangs and Phillies! This is Cecil Robles. You're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM Radio, the sound of the Mustangs and Phillies. Who doesn't love being number one? When your team's dominating the standings, or your favorite band rocks the charts at number one, it feels good, right? Kind of like how it feels when you have auto insurance with State Farm. Because making you feel like number one is an honor your local State Farm agent takes seriously. Through the good times and not so good, your State Farm agent's proud to be here to help life go right. Contact State Farm agent Russell Dial, 310 North Main in Denver City. LG Services in Denver City can handle your oil field service needs with pump trucks, vacuum trucks, haul trucks, winch trucks, light plants, frack tanks, bobcat shredder, clean batteries, and much more. If you need oil field service work done, LG Services in Denver City is the company to call. 806-215-2628. That number again, 806-215-2628. LG Services backing the Denver City Mustangs and Phillies. Welcome back to Philly Softball here. Top of the six, tied at 11. Gutierrez, the batter for Brownfield. And Ali Larea still working in the circle for the Phillies. And the pitch misses upstairs for ball one. Play made out in left field there by the Phillies. Jackie Lozano. Hey, 
Two balls, no strikes, illegal pitch there, they said. So we'll do it again. Two zero count. Foul back. Count goes two one here to Gutierrez. And the league gets set for the two one here. Nobody out, nobody on. And the pitch. Misses low, three one now. And Jeopardy are losing the leadoff batter here. Tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard, top of the sixth. Hit hard on the ground. Ashley Martinez, shortstop, picks it up, throw to first in time for out number one. Good play there by the freshman at short. That'll bring up Franco to the plate for Brownfield. So one out, nobody on. And Franco at the plate. And the pitch misses for ball one. One ball, no strikes here. And Annalise one up. Hit hard out to left center, and he hits at the fence, picked up, and the throw in. She'll stay at first. With a single there by Franco. So Brownfield has the Runner on to take the lead here. That'll bring up Burns. 0 for 3 today. Struck out back in the third. One on and one out. Pitch. Bunt right down the line. Picked up. She picked it up in foul territory. Got to let that one get out. It was going that way. Two on now and one out. Inside for ball one. <clears throat> Runners at first and second with one out. Tied at 11 on the th Thriftway scoreboard here in the top half of the sixth. 1-0 count. And the pitch. Inside, ball two. And Lee's 0-2 inside again now. 3-0. 3-0 count. Three one. Three balls, one strike here. Three one. Misses. That'll put them on. Bases loaded. With one out here in 11-11 ball game. I'll bring up the other Gonzalez. To the plate with the bases loaded. And the pitch. That one's up high. Ball one. One out, the base is loaded. Top half of the sixth, 11 to 11. 
on the Thriftway scoreboard. On the pitch, inside, fouled off. And the count goes even at one and one here to Gonzalez, the center fielder for the Lady Cubs. Here's the pitch. Swung on and missed. One, two goes the count here. Need to get it out right here. Punch out would be great. Here's the pitch from Anali. Popped up. McKaylee Villarreal it hits the in foul territory. And will stay one, two in the count. That would have been a big out there if she could have come up with that. But still, one, two in the count. One out, base is loaded. On a lease pitch. Fouled off. Throwing strikes here. Just get out. Get out here. One ball, two strikes. Here's the pitch from Anna Lee. Swung on and missed. Struck her out. Big strikeout right there by Anna Lee. That'll bring up the nine hole hitter, Bondman, to the plate. So the number nine. At the plate, next inning, the Phillies will bring up four, five, six in the lineup to bat. Here's the pitch. Misses it high. 1-0. <clears throat> Here's the pitch. Over the top of her back. Ball two. Two balls, no strikes. Two balls and no strikes here. To Bondman. Time by the batter. And the 2-0. Misses upstairs and now it's three balls and no strikes here to the nine hole hitter. Bases loaded with two outs, top of the six, tied at 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Gotta just throw strikes here. Make her put it in play, let your defense play behind you and she'll walk in a run. So walk and a run scores. And Brownfield takes an 12-11 lead on the Thriftway scoreboard. Here in the top of the sixth inning. Go to the top of the order for Brownfield with Dominguez. One for four today with a double and the run scored. <laughs> Pitch here to Dominguez. Gets away from her. There's gonna be a play at the play, no. And Brownfield scores. Another run here on the pass ball. Runners at second and third now. Two and 
2 the count. Two-o count. Popped up to center. Mariella Sinisteros under it. Got it. Out number three. But Brownfield will score two runs there in that inning to take a 13 to 11 lead into the bottom half of the sixth. We'll be right back after this. Kill Mud and Chemicals, LLC in Denver City, produces high quality weighted kill and workover fluids in the oil and gas industry. Kill Mud and Chemicals serves West Texas and Eastern New Mexico, operating 24 hours a day, seven days a week to accommodate our customers' needs. Call Mark at 806-215-0751 or stop by the plant at 1570 County Road 390 in Denver City. Kill Mud and Chemicals, a proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. Espinosa Services is proud to support our local businesses. In order to build a strong economy in our hometown area, we'd like to challenge our local businesses to contribute to building a better future for our children. We're proud to be a part of the West Texas community. Espinosa Services is deep-rooted. We support our local businesses and schools, and we strive to build a better surrounding community for all of us. We're so proud to live and work in our small-town communities. Espinosa Services, we've been here, we will be here. This is Doug Duncan, Offensive Coordinator for the Mustangs, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250, Sound of the Mustangs. Hicks Air and Supply, located at 204 North Main in Denver City, is home-owned and operated. 806-592-3930. That's for all your air conditioning and heating repair needs. You'll deal with someone with the tools, the training, and the know-how to make your home more comfortable than you've ever experienced. And if you need a new unit, Hicks Air and Supply can handle that too. Hicks Air and Supply, proud supporters of the Mustangs and the Philly. Stop by Hicks Air and Supply, 204 North Main in Denver City. Welcome back to Philly Softball. Brownfield takes the lead here, going into the bottom of the sixth, 13-11 on the third way scoreboard. Eva Gonzalez at the plate for the Phillies. <clears throat> two for three today with two doubles. Here's a pitch in the dirt. Dominguez still pitching here for Brownfield as we start the sixth. Another one in the dirt. Three oh. Three balls, no strikes. Now you can be up there picky here. Pick out the one you want. In the three, oh, and she'll walk her. Lead-off batter on. Just what the Phillies needed here to start the bottom of the sixth. Yasmin Villarreal comes to the plate. You got three good hitters in a row here in the four, five, six hole. And strike one as she watches that one in. <clears throat> Oh, one. Nice hit. Out into left. And now you've got runners at first and second with nobody out. Good hit there by Jasmine. Ninth hit today for the Phillies. That'll bring up Jacqueline Mendoza. Two home runs. Intentional walked last time. We'll see if he's going to put her on here. <clears throat> no litter bath this time. Stays away from her. 1 0. -oh. 
So it's Brownfield meets at the mound here. See what the best option is to go against. Jacqueline Mendoza. Like I said, hit two home runs in the same inning. And then was intentional walk <clears throat> in the third. Runners at first and second with nobody out. 1-0 count here in the bottom half of the sixth. 13-11 Brownfield lead. And the pitch. Turned on one, hit foul down the line. 1-1 one, one goes the count. One ball, one strike, no out, two runners on for Jacqueline Mendoza. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. And we go 2-1 in the count. <clears throat> two balls, one strike, nobody out here. Bottom of the six down, two runs here. Popped up in the infield. Infield fly rule. So one out. That'll bring up McKaylee Villarreal, the catcher for the Phillies. Flew out and had two base on balls. Scored a run back in the second. That one misses. And the runners will move up. The tying run at second now. One zero. Inside popped up. Out into the outfield. Center fielder makes the catch. And everybody holds on the bags. Two outs. Mia Casara steps to the plate for the Phillies now. Pop up to the pitcher, and that is caught for out number three. So we'll move to the top half of the seventh. The Phillies trail 13-11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. We'll be right back. K and Company Electric, located at 821 North Avenue B in Denver City, is the company to call for all your commercial electrical needs. K and Company Electric serves Yoakum County and the surrounding area in the oil field or on the farm with dependable electrical service. Just give them a call at 806-592-3513. Licensed in Texas and New Mexico, K and Company is the name you've come to know and trust through the years. So when the need calls for commercial electric service, let Kay and Company go do the work for you. This is Jennifer Gonzalez, head softball coach of the Phillies, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of the Phillies. CJR Contractors has been serving the oil field industry with efficient quality work since 1964. With rust about services, backhoes, vacuum excavation, dump trucks, boom lifts, chain link fencing, soil bioremediation, lease operators, oil field maintenance, and much more. You can depend on CJR Contractors for all your oil field service needs. Call 806-592-2558 for efficient, reliable service that you can always depend on. CJR Contractors, located 401 West Broadway in Denver City. This is Celeste Garcia, head cross country coach, and you're listening to KIKZ 1250 AM, Sound of Denver City Sport. Sundown State Bank can handle all your banking needs. Stop in at Sundown State Bank in Denver City, Brownfield, Level Land, Sundown, and Wall. 
You'll always get friendly professional hometown service. Come by 202 West Broadway in Denver City and visit with one of our local bankers for all your personal or business banking needs. Sundown State Bank, a proud supporter of the Mustangs and Phillies. That's Sundown State Bank in Denver City, member FDIC. Welcome back to Philly Softball. This is Starter Cleaves Athletic Trainer. Philly Softball here as we start the top half of the seventh. 13-11 Brownfield lead. And for Brownfield, the leadoff will be number 13, Martinez. Hit to short, stabbed by Ashley Martinez. Throw to first, out number one. So nobody on and one out here in the top of the seventh. Phillies trailed by two runs at 13 to 11 on the Thriftway scoreboard. That will bring up Salas to the plate. Three for four today for her. And the pitch. Right down the middle for strike one. And the old one. Misses. We go 1-1 one, one in the count now here to Salas. Popped up. And it falls in foul territory. Jacqueline Mendoza missed, lost that one in the sun. But the count goes 1-2 here. One ball and two strikes. <clears throat> and the pitch from Annalie. Struck her out. Caught the inside corner of the plate. Two outs now in the inning. That'll bring up Gutierrez to the plate for Brownfield. Two for four today. She scored two runs. Back in the first and the third. <clears throat> two outs and nobody on. Top of the seventh, 13 11 Brownfield lead on the Thriftway scoreboard. Just trying to get out of this inning and then get to work. And a nice job by the freshman, Ashley Martinez, to get the line drive. Three up, three down for the Phillies in the top half of the seventh. We'll move to the bottom of the seventh. Phillies need two to tie it, three to win it. We'll be right back. Want to turn your truck into the ultimate workhorse or off-road beast? The possibilities are endless when you visit Rascal Supply in Seminole. Rascal has truck accessories, spray-in bed liners, bed covers, lift kits, toolboxes, leveling kits, and so much more. Come see us at 1303 North Main or call 432-758-3280 for Rascal Supply on the north side of Seminole. When you need heavy hauling in the oil field, call the experts, Pate Trucking, at 806-592-2772 in Denver City. Pate Trucking has you covered with transports, vacuum trucks, kill trucks, haul trucks, and winch trucks. Call Pate Trucking today for test tanks, frack tanks, pipe trailers, and forklifts. Pate Trucking is the proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. Not 
9-1-2 due up here in the bottom half of the seventh for the Phillies. We'll start it off with Isabella Barrientes, senior second baseman. <clears throat> Got a home run back in the third. There's a hit to the shortstop. They'll field it through to first in time for out number one. And the Phillies down to just two outs. They need to get something going here. Mariela Sinaceros, senior center fielder. She'll come up 0 for 3 today. And the pitch. Outside for ball one. One out, nobody on. 13-11, Brownfield lead. Nice hit out into left field. And a single for Mariela Sinaceros and a great time to get your first hit of the ball game. Right here when you need one, puts a runner on first with one out. And up to the plate, Ashley Martinez. She's had a heck of a game in the field and at the plate. Home run back in the first. Use another one of those, it'd tie it right here on one swing. Strike on the outside corner of the plate. 0-1 oh, count here. And the pitch. 1-1 one, one goes the count. One ball, one strike, one out, runner on first for the Phillies. Down to two outs here, down two. Tie and run at the plate. 2-1. Throw down back to first, not in time. Two balls, one strike here to Ashley Martinez. And the pitch, up high. 3-1. Annalie Larea on deck. Eva Gonzalez in the hole. And the pitch. Hit hard to short. Field it to get one at second and safe at first. So two outs. Phillies down to their final out here. He hit into the fielder's choice there. Anneli Larea, pitcher at the plate. First pitch, ball one. One ball, no strikes here. Two outs and a runner at first. The tying run at the plate. Down to the final out here. 13-11 Brownfield lead. Here's the pitch. Misses the zone. 2-1 goes the count. 2-0 goes the count. 2-0. That one. Called strike high in the zone. Ball gets away out in the outfield. Heads up play by Ashley Martinez to get to second. Build the tying run at the plate with Anna Lee. Two balls, one strike, two outs, runner at second. 13-11 lead for Brownfield. Here's the pitch from Dominguez. And that one misses inside. 3-1 goes the count. Three balls, one strike. Here's the 3-1. Hit hard to second, and she'll fumble with it, and will score a run. We get one step closer there. 
Eva Gonzalez at the plate for the Phillies. Two outs, tying run at first, winning run at the plate. And the pitch. Popped up. Trying to get to it at the fence, and it falls in foul territory for strike one. Well, it was close. Really close. <clears throat> Eva's got two doubles here today. And the pitch. Misses the zone. 1-1. One, 1-1 one. One, one count here. One ball, one strike. Two outs, a runner at first. The tying run at, fir at first. And the pitch. Misses high. 2-1. Two, Two balls, one strike. Jasmine Villarreal on deck for the Phillies. And that one hit her. Two on. That'll bring up Jasmine Villarreal to the plate. Jacqueline Mendoza on deck with two home runs today. And Brownfield will have a meeting in the circle here. Bottom half of the seventh, 13-12. Two outs and runners at first and second for the Phillies. Jasmine Villarreal at the plate. The winning run at first. We've got to get the tying run from second in first to extend this ball game. Two outs. Here's the pitch. High in the zone. Ball one. Two balls, no strikes. Two balls, no strikes. Three balls. Three balls and no strikes. The pitch. Walker. And the bases are loaded. For Jacqueline Mendoza. Two homers today for her. She'll step to the plate. She's had two. We'll ask her for one more right here. But a base hit into the outfield in the gap will score two runs and win the ball game. Tie and run at third. And the pitch. And it hit her. The tie and run walks to the plate. The Phillies have tied it here in the bottom of the seven. Thirteen thirteen. Now that'll bring up McKaylee Villarreal. Nope. 
That one in there for ball one to McKaylee Villarreal. The walk, hit by pitch, base hit. We'll walk it off here for the Phillies. And the pitch. Fouled off. 1-1 one, one goes to count. One one count here. Two outs, the base is loaded. Tied at 13, in the bottom of the seventh. And the pitch. Misses. 2 1. Two balls, one strike. Here's the pitch. Hit. Flared out to right. Coming in to make the play, and she got it. We'll play extra innings here today as we move to the top half of the eighth. Tied at 13 on the Thriftway scoreboard. We'll be right back after this. Quality truck tires in Denver City can handle all your tire needs. Light truck, passenger tires, and commercial truck tires with all major brands to choose from. Michelin, BF Goodrich, Cooper, and Hercules. Remember, Quality truck tires can also take care of your vehicle maintenance needs, oil and filter change, vehicle alignment, brake work, air conditioner service, and much more. For all your vehicle tire and maintenance needs, give Quality Truck Tire a call at 806-592-2152 or stop by the shop at 112 North Highway 214 in Denver City. Go Mustangs and Phillies. When it comes to irrigation systems for your crops, you can measure quality by the length of the warranty. Compare Rain Keys to the others, and others come up short. Rain Keys 10-year, 10,000-hour wheelbox warranty is the longest in the industry. See Banman Irrigation and Supplies in Denver City today about Rain Keys long-lasting warranties and ask about extending the gearbox warranty on your existing system by two years, regardless of brand. Banman Irrigation and Supplies in Denver City, 806-592-2011. Take a break from the ordinary and drive into Sonic of Denver City today for a refreshing cold Coca-Cola. While you're there, try one of our delicious hot dogs. To make it even better, top your meal off with an extraordinary real ice cream shake. Don't forget to take advantage of our happy hour from 2 to 4 p.m. daily for half-priced drinks and slushes, especially Coca-Cola. This is How You Sonic. Back to Philly softballs. We go to extra innings. Tied at 13 on the Thriftway scoreboard. We move to the top of the eighth. Up to bat for Brownfield will be Franco. One for four today for Franco. First pitch hit it. Ashley Martinez, the freshman, stabs it. Throw to first. Got her. In time, out number one. Bring up Burns to the plate <clears throat> now for Brownfield. One out, nobody on. And the pitch. And she went. Strike one. The 
No balls and a strike. One out. Nobody on. Here's the pitch to Burns. 1-1. One, one. Here's the pitch. Fouled off. One and two the count now with one out. Nobody on. Here's the one two from Anali. Misses. Two two. Two balls, two strikes, one out, nobody on. Here's the pitch. Fouled off. We'll do it again at two and two. Top of the eight, tied at 13. The pitch. Swung on, hit right at Ashley Martinez. Picks it up, throw to first. Got her. She's out. Two plays by the freshman shortstop. And two outs in the inning now. Nobody on. <clears throat> Coming to the plate will be the third baseman, Gonzalez. She reached on a fielder's choice in the first. Base on ball, scored a run in the third. Flat out to right in the fifth. And a base on balls in the sixth. Two outs, nobody on. Here's the pitch. Hit in the dirt. Picked up by Anna Lee. Throw to first. Not in time. Runner will hold it first. Two outs. Runner at first. Bring up the other Gonzalez center fielder. One for four today for her. Two outs and a runner on first. And the pitch right down the middle, strike one. Two more like that. Do up for the Phillies will be 8-9-1 in the bottom of the eighth. And the pitch. Inside, and we go 1-1 one, one in the count now. Two outs and a runner on first. And a lead with a 1-1. One, one. The count goes 2 1. Two balls and a strike now. Here to Lee. Two balls and one strike here to Gonzalez. <clears throat> Inside pitch, hit down the line to left. Runner round second, headed for third, and she'll hold it third. Runners at second and third now with two outs in the inning. So be the nine hole hitter, Bondman. One hit today for her. And the pitch. Nice pitch there. Strike one. Keep them right there. Here's the 
Here's the pitch from Monali. E. I thought that one caught the plate right there. Nice pitch. 1-1. One, one. And a 1-1 one, one from Monali. Swung on. Popped up. In the left. It's deep and it is gone. A two-run shot by the nine-hole hitter. And we see yet another home run here today. We had two outs and nobody on. Now we go down 16 to 13 after that three-run shot. I'll put them back at the top of the order with Dominguez. Here's Dominguez at the plate. This will be her sixth at bat today. One for five. Strike one to start her off. Here's one for five in the one hole. And the pitch. Hit down the first base line, off the glove, picked up, throw over, got her. Ooh, that was close, but he got her. So we move to the bottom of the eighth inning with Brownfield up by three, 16-13. The Phillies are going to have to rally again. We'll be right back. Hudson Trucking in Denver City can handle your oil field trucking needs. Give Brady Shivers a call at 432-847-9026 or Rodney at 806-215-6946. Hudson Trucking is locally owned and operated, serving Denver City and the surrounding area with vacuum and pump trucks. You can rely on Hudson Trucking to get the job done right with fast, efficient service. That's Hudson Trucking, a proud supporter of Denver City and its youth. Yoakum County Hospital is always looking for new team members who have a shared passion for our core values of dignity, excellence, service, and justice. If you'd like to be considered for an opportunity with Yoakum County Hospital, go to ych.us slash careers. YCH provides excellent benefits such as employer paid health, cancer and life insurance, competitive salaries and many other benefits. Optional dental, vision, flex plan and ICU coverage is also available. This is Derek Fott, head basketball coach of the Mustangs, and you're listening to KIKZ, 1250 AM, Sound of the Mustangs. Just Cash, located inside Just Supplies in Denver City, makes it hassle-free to get cash for many types of checks, including payroll checks, personal checks, business checks, income tax refund checks, and more. Just Cash also offers longer service hours than many banks. So just stop in today at Just Cash, 825 East Broadway in Denver City, or call 806-592-5878. Well, they overturned the call safe at first on the close play. So two outs and a runner on first, 16-13. Brownfield lead. Back to the top of the eight. Two outs, <clears throat> a runner on first. Popped up to first, and she makes the play. Oh, 
So just like that, we get back out of it. And we'll move to the bottom of the eighth now. 16, 13. Dandy Service Company proudly supports the Denver City Mustangs and Phillies. The next time you need dirt work done, large or small, call Dandy Service Company, 806-592-3362. Dump trucks, maintainers, and all the heavy equipment you need to get the job done. When you call Danny Service Company, you can be assured the job is done right at, by Danny Service Company on the Lovington Highway in Denver City or call 806-592-3362. Owner Tommy Durham and crew are proud to support the Mustangs and Phillies. West Texas National Bank in Denver City and 12 other locations in West Texas is your one-stop financial institution. West Texas National has all the modern banking conveniences, internet banking and debit cards to traditional accounts, an experienced professional to help with every type of loan, farm and ranch real estate loans for row crop to cattle, ag equipment loans, commercial business loans to home loans, all types of vehicle loans, even recreation vehicles to small consumer purchases. We're West Texas National Bank of Denver City. Freedom Bail Bonds offers fast and reliable assistance with surety bonds and we're open 24-7. Since 1985, we've been providing top-notch service and can help you every step of the way with utmost privacy, professionalism, and speed. A call to Freedom Bail Bond should be your first good decision when you or a loved one is involved in this type of unfortunate situation. Call us at 432-758-3234. Serving Gaines, Yoakum, Dawson, and Andrews County. Welcome back to Philly Softball. Now here in the bottom of the eighth, Phillies are going to have to score three runs to tie it and extend the ball game. First pitch misses for ball one. To lead it off for the Phillies will be Mia Casares. Strike one. One one goes to Gallon. One ball, one strike here. Nobody on, nobody out. And the pitch from Dominguez. Gets away from her. Two one. Two one. Here's the pitch. Low in the zone. Three one. Three balls, one strike. Nobody on, nobody out. Bottom half of the eighth. 16 13 Brownfield. Here's the three one from Dominguez. Hit on the ground to second. Scooped up. Throw to first in time for out number one. Isabella Barrientes at the plate. And a home run back in the third. In the pitch, in the dirt, ball one. One out, nobody on. to Isabella. Go 2-0 in the count now. Two balls, no strikes. Here's the pitch. Now we'll go 2-1. Two, two balls, one strike here. One on and missed. 2-2 two, two now. One out, nobody on. Two balls, two strikes here to Isabella. Bottom of the eighth, down three. Full count. Full count here. 
And she walks him. So a runner at first with one out. Go to the top of the order, Mariela Ceniceros. Had a big shot down the third base line in the seventh to start the rally. And the pitch. Up high in the zone for ball one. Runner at first with one out. Expects her to hit that, but one one. One ball, one strike here. One out, runner at first for the Phillies. Bottom of the eighth. Got away from her. Throw down the first, not in time. Two balls and one strike. Two balls, one strike. Here's the pitch. 3-1. 3-1. Tying run on deck with Ashley Martinez. <clears throat> and a 3-1. Popped up. It's in no man's land, kind of right in the middle, and it falls. Base hit for Mariela Ceniceros. Runners on first and second now. Ashley Martinez, the freshman. She's had a heck of a ball game today. Big shot out to right. Will it stay fair? Foul. Would have scored two and maybe three. Well, they got in the gap. It would have been a ground roll double. <laughs> oh, one. Hit the second. They'll take the out at first. There's that second and third now with two outs. <clears throat> There's that second and third on Ali Larea at the plate for the Phillies. One for five today. That's in the dirt. Ball one. Here's the pitch. Up in the zone, two balls, no strikes. Two outs, runners at second and third. Tying run at the plate with Anali. Nice hit in the gap. That'll score one run for the Phillies. That'll score two runs for the Phillies. Uh-oh. Caught in no man's land. Safe. Yeah, that was close. Now the tying run. is at second. The winning run steps to the plate with Eva Gonzalez. And the pitch to Eva. Misses. 1-0. 16-15 here in the bottom of the eighth. Second with two outs. Here's the pitch to Eva. In the dirt. 2-0. Two 
Two balls, no strikes. Eva Gonzalez at the plate for the Phillies. Swung on, hit down the line, deep, and gone! Eva Gonzalez walks it off for the Phillies! On a two-run shot, and the Phillies win 17 to 16. Wow, what a ball game. Had to come from behind three times in this ball game. We'll take a break. We'll come back and wrap this one up. Phillies win it in eight, 17-16. Farmers and ranchers are the backbone of America, working from sunup to sundown, taking care of the land and the livestock, and providing food and fiber for the world. Farmers are our heroes, the ones who make daily sacrifices and face harsh challenges so that we may all enjoy the fruits of their labors. It's the hardworking men and women of agriculture that provide economic security in rural communities and beyond. So we celebrate the men and women that rise up against factors outside of their control to provide for their fellow man. Ellison Farms is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. Looking for a place to find gifts for a birthday or a special holiday or just something for yourself? Look no further than That So Cute Resin. We specialize in personalized, unique gifts from pins, badge reels, dominoes, earrings, personalized cups, and memory preserving items. You name it, we probably can do it. Call 806 215 4876 or look us up on Facebook and Instagram. That So Cute Resin is a proud supporter of the Mustangs and the Phillies. What a ball game. Phillies walk it off in eight. 17 16 on the Thriftway scoreboard. Phillies tallied 12 hits today. Overcame those three errors. Brownfield had 13 hits in one error. We saw eight long balls today, five by the Phillies, three by Brownfield. And Brownfield goes to 0-2 in district play, and the Phillies go to 1-1 in district play, and that is their first district win in, I think, about three years. So congratulations to the Phillies. Way to fight today. Had to come back three different times. So we'll go through here. Brownfield scored four in the first, and the Phillies came up with one in the first. They held Brownfield to no runs in the second. The Phillies would score seven in the second. Nope, seven. Nine in the second, sorry. And then Brownfield would score three in the third. The Phillies would score one in the third. Then the Phillies would go scoreless in the fourth, fifth, and sixth inning and fall behind, score two in the bottom of the seventh to extend the ball game, give up three runs in the eighth, and then walk it off in the bottom of the eighth. We'll have Mustang baseball on Saturday from Muleshoe. The Phillies will play at the same time in Muleshoe as the Mustangs for Bo Wells, KIKZ. And softball, Philly softball. Good night, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your week. Thank you so much for joining us for our coverage of Denver City High School Sports on KIKZ AM 1250, KIKZKSCM.com, and on YouTube at KIKZ 1250DC. A special thanks to our sponsors and friends of the station and the Denver City Independent School District who help us bring you coverage of Denver City Sports. Join us next time for our coverage of Denver City High School Sports on KIKZ.